Hey everybody, DSJ here, the one and only Ultimate Nerd. Welcome back to Yoshi's Woolly World. It's time to go on to World 5. Let's do this. We finished World 4 the last time. And of course, we have an ice world. Yeah, I feel like using that, because why not? Alright, let's do this. Yeah, it look like I need some eggs. No! Ah, stupid shy guy. No! Oh, you get to spit some out. Cool. Oops. I did not mean to do that. You know what? I just need one of you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on. Keep spitting them out. There you go. Give me them shy guys, buddy. I just realized how those steps look. It kind of remind me of the original Super Mario Brothers on, you know, stairs to the flagpole. I don't know why that made me think about that. Yeah, if you try and get to Florida, that's the only way to get that thing. Oh yeah, I have magnetic powers, that's right. Okay, I have to go through this side. Oh, I can't go in the pipe. Dang. Same way it's always done in the original Yoshi's Island. Ah. Yeah, I kind of need you. I think I kind of screwed myself over here. Dang. All right. Okay. Yeah, I think I screwed up. Let's 
slippery ice platforms. Usually, I love ice level. You know what? Uh, it depends on the game at this point. Because, you know, in some Mario games, I love the ice levels, but there's others I can't stand it. I think it's more or less when it comes to most ice, le ice levels. I love the way it Whoa! I love the way it looks. Well, shoot, I just, I just died. I wonder. Uh, I guess that's a done deal. Never mind. Oh, great. I'm about to die again. Okay, Yoshi, run for dear life. Should be right there at the end. Yep. But like I said, I when it comes to ice levels, I always love the way they look. I just can't stand the physics. Cause you know in real life, ice is slippery. You can hurt yourself. <laughs> But you know, when you see ice and snow, you just marvel at its beauty. But as soon as you step foot and slip on something, you regret even stepping outside at that point. And quite honest, when when I was younger, I never could understand. I've always been obsessed with snow because I love the way it looks. I like I love the activities we've done with snow like well basically sitting inside sitting in front of a nice fireplace enjoy time with your family you know just watch like something wholesome together you know Or you might be like me or, or listen to any video game soundtrack that deals with a snow level. Like, I would listen to Ice Cap Act 1 and Act 2 from um, Sonic 3. Or find stupid reasons to go to Iceland on Super Mario Bros. 3. Oh, that is actually neat. Because I never could freeze that thing in the original code. Well, you never see the items that allow you to do that. Oh, boy. Sniff it, Stecker actually blow out snow and ice. just a flower. No, 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 don't push me back. Yeah, push me forward. Thank you. And is that a whale? Uh, 
Oh. Huh. I actually ignored that before. What's your... Oh, not the mermaid again. There we go. Uh. Yeah, let's not waste too much time there. Did not work in my favor, like, at all. You would. And it did. Oh yeah, I'm not trying to 100% this game. I keep forgetting that. Oh! Hidden pipe, going in! So far, uh. oh, yeah, these do fade eventually. Go on down. Full health. Yeah, go back down. Thank you. Ow! Huh? use you. Gotcha. Going in. Oh, are you supposed to freeze me? Holy shit, yes you are. I'm not even mad at you for that. That was actually clever. <laughs> so was the way to end this level, I'm not gonna lie. Oh yeah, a bonus game. I know I sound bored, 
but yeah. I don't really get anything when it comes to these bonus games. It's more or less all I get is more beads. I have infinite lives. Two players will actually help trying to collect all this. Yeah, collecting bees, I... When it comes to the bonus stage, I really don't care about. I don't know. We're taking it to the skies, y'all. And it's a flying carpet cruise. Oh. That was it. Can't be any worse than Rainbow Ride. As soon as I said that. I am already reminded of Rainbow Ride. have some control of the carpet. I don't mind that one bit. Cause I really don't want Rainbow Ride um PTSD again. Just no. Cause honestly, that world on Mario 64 and TikTok clock could just go to hell. I'm just saying because those two worlds are the most unenjoyable for me, especially when I'm trying to 100% it. If you want to see my frustration, yeah, watch my Mario 64 playthrough. Whoa! I got di no. Great. And I got people blowing gust now. That's just no, 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 no. Game. We might have to have a little talk. And it's called Don't Screw Me Over, Please. And I screwed myself over. I needed the small one. And you know what? It's not worth it. Just keep going. Oh. Wow. Piranha Plant. Because, yes. Huh, at least I have max health. That works. Uh. No. Uh oh. No. I'm actually afraid what would happen if that hits the. Oh, nothing. Never mind. 
fears are now invalid. This is like New Super Mario Brothers U with the um lone thing and enemies will weigh it down. At least there's no countdown will make it pretty much self-destruct, so I can live with that to a certain extent. And the item box also weighs me down. I'm not gonna be a happy. No, it doesn't actually. Good. Oh, good. I'm at the end. And we made it. I might have to start actively avoiding the flowers. Because <laughs> I don't want to deal with the bonus games here. Yoshi's Island? I don't mind the, um... Bonus games for the mere reasons I could get immediate satisfaction out of them. Like extra lives. And lives mattered back then. And items. That would help me 100% certain, st certain stages. Big Montgomery Heights for it. Oh, not Big Montgomery again? Come on. Ooh. Oh my goodness, this looks beautiful. Here's here's some here's something that I don't mind saying. You know the one game I wish Nintendo would on remake? And yes, it's a Game Boy game. The game we call Donkey Kong 94. Or GB Donkey Kong. Because I'm not going to lie. That game wasn't the first um, Game Boy game I've ever played, but it was the first Game Boy game I ever owned. And that was around the time when I bought the Super Game Boy. And to me, that game stood on its own. It, it wasn't just like a, um, a retelling of the original Donkey Kong. It was like we're going to make you work for a good ending. And you know what? I appreciate it. No, 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 no. I'm dead. But like I said, uh, I appreciate what that game done. Because, well, instead of being like the same four stages, if you play the arcade version, or three stages minus one if you played the NES version. Instead of just that, and you rescue Pauline and call it a day? It made you work for the end by making you going through eight more worlds. And it became puzzle based. And you know what? It was fine. Because it kept the difficulty in um in the, no in the same realm of the physics of the original Donkey Kong because if they kept it at the physics of any other Mario game, guess what? Mario would not suffer like a lot of hazards like at all, like falling from a height. Cause I'm like one of them people that played Super Mario Brothers first and and the original Donkey Kong later on the NES and it kind of and you know I see Mario falling from a height <laughs> and then die from it 
that's when I really questioned everything. I was like, wait a minute. This is the same Mario, right? <laughs> Oh man, I'm. I, I better pay attention. Because I'm enjoying the look of this stage way too much. Ah, hell. Oh, that was a lucky shot. Honestly, I shouldn't even made that shot. Well, I definitely got no eggs. Let's just keep it going. But you know what? That was actually worth it. Whoa. I don't remember this penguin's name is the name Bumpty or Bumpity something like that. Uh, I actually forgot the enemy's name. Oh well. I hate the fact you can't turn them into eggs. Ouch. You know it'd be a crazy matchup. When the penguin enemies meet, um, when the penguin enemy from the Yoshi series meet the penguinator from Sonic 3, that would be nuts. I actually hope one day Mario and Sonic really do get a a proper crossover game. I mean, granted, the Olympic games are not too bad. It's just... They're both platformers. They both need a crossover platforming game. 2D or 3D, it doesn't matter. Mario proved time and time again that he could work on either plane. Sonic proved it could work on both planes. Granted, there some of his 3D outings are questionable, but it still functions. Unless you're Sonic 06, but even I have to admit that game's a guilty pleasure of mine. Because I played that game way too many times than I should ever have. Okay, here's where he, I just never understood Kamek, really. You went from calling him Yoshi, Yoshi baby from the original Yoshi's Island, and to this, the Yoshi Kins, it's just like, dude, what even are you? Oh, he has a helmet. Wow, and that served no purpose for him. What you gonna do, drop spike balls and more? Really? 
Oh, snowball effect, okay. Good. Yep. You cause yourself to become a detriment. Oh, I think that's just gonna push me off the edge and nothing more, okay. Nope. Yeah, that was literally no challenge. I wonder what's next in World 5. I got a new power badge, okay. <laughs> something tells me that power badge is something along the lines of... F Forever Flame Watermelon. All you can eat, all you can eat, fire watermelon. Oh, okay. Yeah, I saw that one coming because oh, wait a minute, I don't have the ice one yet. But I have the regular. That makes sense. Yeah, let's go with no badges here. A little light snowfall. Oh, I just caused the avalanche. I'm sorry, shy guys. Yeah, let's keep going. Oh, good. It's just a matter of convenience. One thing I did wonder though. What's this? You look like a pit. It is a pit. Nope. And those are the branches that came off the tree, so. Okay, the fact that the monkey's actually throwing little snow yarns, that's pretty cute. Pipe. See, yeah, sometimes this might be a lengthy stage here. Okay. Oh, wait a minute, it does do damage. Wow. I thought it was just a mild inconvenience that pushed you out the way. Now I know better. Whoa! Even though I love how clever this stage is, it's... It's gonna get me killed. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank goodness they didn't crush Yoshi. So I'm too busy um enjoying the the aesthetics of this stage and I'm losing track of myself and that is not good. Cause that's a one way ticket of getting killed. Whoa. Oh boy. This. Oh, good. Cloud time. It, whoa. Yeah, I'm out of here. Outright ignored it. Huh. Didn't I know there was stuff up here? Wow, that was it? That's lame. Oh, it's still here. Neat. Oh, yes, yeah, give me Mega Yoshi. Thank you. That's right, Mega Yoshi, destroy everything. Nope, I still got time. circle and there's the last one <laughs> that you want to know how that Yoshi looks <laughs> that I got all the own spools of yarn Did not actively avoid those like I said I was.
I don't understand those. It's like I can't get no. F probably the highest I remember ever getting is probably um. Fifteen hundred. For the bonus game. I can't get any higher than that. Star Yoshi, huh? I might have to use you. Yep. Come on, Star Yoshi. It's a maze. And it's an annoying one at that. Love the music. I love the way the stage looks. I'm not gonna lie, I hate the stage itself though. And I think I screwed up. We're about to find out. I did. Cause look, I'm back at the beginning. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Checkpoint. This music, I'm not gonna lie, as good as it is, it, it could put you to sleep. Which in turn could lull you in a false sense of security. I 
I just screwed myself over. Oh my god. I am going in a complete circle. Alright. Do not go down this time. Go up. close. That actually looks more correct. There we go. Problem solved. Oh crap. I did not see those spikes there. No! Come on. Huh? Oh, there we go. No! Dang it! Come on. I just want to get up there. Oh, God, that was close. I should be close to the end. Yep. Let's get out of here. I'm actually glad that stage is over. Six seven? I mean five seven dang. I'm trying to push myself to the end, huh? Oh no. 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 This is not Mario Six Four PTSD this time. This is straight up Yoshi's Island PTSD. And so this stage is more of a dick. Yeah, it really is. I just want to make sure I survive this. Don't do anything extra.
I don't know why I took that chance. Yeah. This is giving me flashbacks of 5 2 and 5 3 from the original Yoshi's Island. Those ski lifts. <laughs> because they always hover over a pit. And this is the case that you have to aim your yarn balls to make sure you don't go falling. And the fact I'm at the mercy of a bullet bill. It's not cool. Whoa! No. Oh good, I need a health, for once. Okay, just gotta be careful. And not die. Dying sucks. <laughs> Oh good, I'm out of here. Oh, it's not over, is it? Nope. And of course it's this. Oh no, yep. Uh-uh. You're not gonna take me out, not that easily. Oh, no. Oh, what the hell. Oh, that just dropped. No big deal. This just dropped to my death. Why it comes to Yoshi games... Row five is either is always a snow and sky level together. Except this one did it in reverse from Yoshi's Island. Oh God, no! Y'all need to leave. I did not collect one flower. I do not care. Yeah, because Yoshi's Island, it started off as snow, then went to sky. Yoshi's story is mainly sky. Because parts of World 3 was, well, snow. Okay. No, it didn't do it in reverse. It did it the same order. My fault.
Five eight. We're about to finish this world. Sniff bird to unfeelings castle. The names. Oh! Oh! Not cool, game. No! No! I died the same way. Yeah, you could go. Oh yeah, if I'm not mistaken, these could crash me too. Yep, yeah, nope. I never get enough of that baseline, but now is not the time to admire it. Could these sniffits are legit dangerous right now? You know what? I don't care. Let's just keep it going. I know I probably missed some bonuses and oh great. Oh my god. No. Hell no. Half this crap is not worth it. Just keep it. Oh, no. Ah! Uh, yeah, I was proven right. You can get crushed by those. I was actually trying to get up out of there and I died anyway. Are you serious? Okay. Fine. No. Oh my god, no. Oh, duck. Oh, hold up. I was right there at the door. Huh. That was too close. Oh, I'm getting on your nerves. Stop putting me through this. I thought it was a lizard or a dragon. You pretty much indicate I'm a dinosaur, but then again, it is dinosaur in the Mario universe. Of course. 
It's kind of funny how the music does this. Um, start do start changing up when you attack them. So look. What are we doing this now? Really? Wow. You just set yourself up for failure, huh? Bring it. Okay, it's time to take you out now. Your ice spike balls do not scare me. Oh! Whoa! Okay. He's pissed. He's legitimately pissed. I can't afford to get hit again. Oh, thank goodness. Battle over. And there goes World 5. Wow. He almost took me out. I guess that's the all you can eat on. Ice watermelon. You're going for it, huh, Kamek? The final world. Alright, next time on Yoshi's Willy World, we will tackle World 6. I guess that is Bowser's Castle. This was DSJ, and remember everybody, let's all nerd the heck out. See you guys next time.